Hey everybody, so I wanted to just update you on what we had going on. Thank you so much for stopping by our kitchen while we cook today. So yesterday, you know, I did a lot of cook ahead meals and I made a couple things. I made the cabbage and the brisket. I did the spaghetti squash and the sauce and here's my brisket. So I pulled it all together today and I did a little bit of a remix on the cook aheads. I actually made egg roll in a bowl with shrimp because I had some shrimp. I got that on sale at Food Line, I think. And so I just fried up my cabbage like I normally would. It was the cabbage and the carrot mixture. I think it was $1.49 for the bag. And then I threw in the shrimp that were on sale this week. I pulled the brisket out to make uh, the um, Philly brisket steaks. And so I just warmed up the cabbage to go along with the brisket steaks in my fry pan. And of course you can just see some of the carrots that are in there. And then a few pieces of the brisket meat that got left, left in there. This right here is my spaghetti squash. And I added in the sausage and the marinara sauce. But then tonight I added in about 6 ounces of the Italian tomato basil herb chicken and sprinkled it with a half a cup of the Parmesan cheese. It's a light Parmesan. It's from Food Line, and it's only 20 calories per serving. And then what I did was I pulled the brisket out of the cabbage and uh, carrot, and I toasted some hoagie rolls. I threw in an onion and some mini peppers into a fry pan, saute those up. I took the brisket out of the crock pot cold, threw it into the peppers and the onions, sauteed it around, and then I just laid it on top of the toasted hoagie rolls with two slices of that Sargento's Ultra Thin Provolone Cheese. And then if anybody wants to have the Thousand Island dressing on top of that, they can have that. So my son is home, and I always like to do a good meal when he is here. He said he had been craving some of this, so I'm thankful I had that on hand. And the rest of it, um, I can eat this without worrying about the amount of too many smart points and also the cabbage I can have without too many smart points. And I have plenty of points left to use for the day. So anyway, just thought we'd bring you along to our kitchen to see what we can do with our Make Ahead Remakes. So until next time we cook, bye.